Hi guys, welcome to episode 3 of our Luton Youth Academy regens. We start off with a squad report. Homebell is a 75, 55 to 75. Slippers a 83 and Yam is a 78. We jump into our first game guys. This is our second pre-season game. Our first game corrupted, which was a bit of a bummer. We won 1-0 and this comes into a tough game against Stevenage. Hopefully we can get a good result against them guys. Please if you can like and comment and subscribe of course. Let's see what we can do guys. This kind of atmosphere right. when you've got the crowd behind you. painful. If this is all I'm doing for 90 minutes, then I might as well just put the control down. Because this is what this has just been. This has just been painful. Come on, Steven. At least liven up the game. Ah, uh, oh my This is just. This is the worst. This must be literally one of the worst games I have ever played in my life. Just dire, to say the least. Jeez, oh, that nearly snuck in at me. Uh, that was close. Oh well, no one else, guys. Listen about that, the better. Jump into our final pre-season game, guys, of the group stages. This is against Swindon Town. I would say, guys, if we can draw this game, we are shorted. As long as we don't lose, I think it will come down to the Port Vale Stevenage game. Because I think if Port Vale win, then we might sneak in. But let's see what we can do and hope for a good Referee result. Blows, I want to win. I would like to win the preseason because it gets us a good bit of money for potential scouts. But let's see what we can do because I'm quite excited about this. But Swindon will probably be a team that's going to be challenging for the title, guys. That's my personal opinion. So see what we can do and see how we play. This is looking not too great a start. A few minutes in. Right, come on. Come on. Oh, come on! I thought I had that. That was a bit painful. Ah, oh, well. Four minutes in and we're a goal down. I thought I had that, to be honest. That was a... That was a... Mm, that's a bit of an odd one. I genuinely thought I had that ball. And... Keller's not going to get there. As good as he's so far been for us. The fence a bit shaky maybe in the end. Sigmund's not happy. I'm... Bit gutted, they're not a great that is not the start we wanted five minutes in. One nil down, we're gonna have to pick ourselves up big time if we have to, any chance goal, of getting back into this game because I do not want to lose this. Cause I don't know how our results may pan out for us. See what we can do from there. Right, come on, this is just getting bad to worse, bad to worse. Where's the defence? Come on! Defence! Oh god almighty. Two 0 and I don't think I'm getting back now. This is painful. Balmy. Oh, well, good goal. Come on, come on. Get on. Oh, that's a nice free goal. 2 1. Five minutes to go. Could we sneak it? Could we sneak a goal? I don't quite doubt that. Uh, don't quite think that even because we're not playing too great. So I'm going to have to pick up my game and see how the rest of this goes because we might sneak into the semis. I don't know, but. I'm going to have to just hope for the best, especially after this, because goal dif even goals might go, goal, uh, the goal difference might come into a factor. But Fidelity, well taken goal. Nice exciting Swiss talent from Alikin. Uh, come on. Last attack. Come on, Kagawa. Come on. Oh, oh why did I pass there? Should have just run it in. in ah, well. Time. That's my chance gone. Waiting for it. Yep. There we go, guys. Pity. So, McCoy, there's a big thing, guys. He sold and we had four transfer offers in for him. And he eventually went to Zaragoza. We got an extra £300,000 practically. And of course, they're not delighted with that, but it's unfortunate. We'll jump into our um, report, guys. Um, what am I saying? I don't know what I'm saying. August squad report Hoff is a 66 to 86, Dyer is a 73 to 79, Itu is a 75 to 94. He looks really tasty by the way, I might get him up sooner. Lewis is a 71 to 87. 
My bill was a 76 to 82, Norris a 74 to 80, Costa Keat is a 71 to 85, Thompson, Thomas is a 62 to 78, Doyle is a 75 to 81, Sigmund is a 75 to 81, Barbarous is a 69 to 85, Matthew Ruse is a 75 to 91, M Milos Amini is an 81 to 87, one M Spadler. Riyama is a 69 to 85, and Simon Helg is a 59 to 77. Looking some not bad talents, guys, and that's a good score report. And Zane Banton, he is getting dumped as quick as we can. 60,000, I'm not caring, it goes into the kitty. We want the money, and the wages out. Another transfer offer guys, this was Danny Green, we wanted 425, we wanted his value but we've got 400 and that gets him out as well. Delighted. Jump into our first official league game guys, and this is against Port Vale again. We played them in pre-season and beat them and we've got them again, first game of the season. This is going to be a good fun, guy, uh, fun game guys, I genuinely do not know what to expect against Port Vale after the league, uh, the pre-season game, but um They'll be desperate to get back on um, back on us, and I feel but quite the confident going into this game that we can beat them again, because why not? We well. played well yeah, in the pre-season game, and if we play well defensively, ball, except for the game against Swindon, we have so far played pretty well defensively, the and there's the big man Keller, today. real good talent, and... I'm really excited for him, and the team in general looks pretty decent, of course Port Vale, um, nothing we're going to be too focused on, Leach Smith, obviously the main danger man, um, but we're not focused on Port the Port Vale side, we don't want to think about them, we want to obviously focus on our main team guys, on our bunch of youth talent that is developing, of Keller, Lingard, Sigmund, Gavranovic, Suter, Goodwin, Thompson, Pearson, Fidili, Foster and Ambrose. Wait, a 4-5-1 guys with two attacking mids and it, I'm looking forward to this. See what we can do. And I really want to get, a, I really want to start the, the league with a win. Because I feel the first five games are going to be the difference maker for me at the start. Because if I can't get, say, three out of five, then we, we could probably spend the first proper season in League One. Mid-table of course is the objective but we want to try and push for promotion with this young talented team. See what we can do guys and look for an exciting game. That's a good start. Come on Fidel. Ah oh, come on. That's going to be a penalty ref but it's a bit debatable for a penalty. Oh well read Ambrose. Young She Ambrose. Young 53 rated striker or whatever. Oh pinged in! You beautiful talent. That is something. That was a bit unexpected, pinging that one in. He did not plan that, clearly. But that is just, not the quickest. Ambrose. The fence were a bit, giving him the space and Ambrose just pinged that in beautifully. Absolute brilliant. Goalie's not got near that at all. The fence are a bit over the place. 1-0, what a start. Shea Ambrose, proven already in the league that he is a young little talent to keep an eye on. Well taken son, great goal. This is looking just so great just now. Oh that is a, that maybe a, oh come on, that was a bit lucky, come on, that is a beautiful two. That man again, it's Ambrose and he is absolutely class. For being about 53 rated guys. He is just banging them in for fun. Folk would generally say, oh, why bring up a guy that's 50 rated? Well, I've just proven with young Ambrose, he is buying two goals in. He is absolutely talented as hell. And I think he had a good potential as well, if I remember right. But two goals in his first game in the league. And that is just delightful, guys. He's just a talent. 